back everybody yes we are back in mafia 2 the definitive edition time to get some more of this done um let me see in the story mode let me see real quick i think we've got i don't know how many chapters left uh, right now we're on balls and beans so we will continue our story Uh. All right. <sighs> Hope everybody's doing well. Hope everybody's had a good week so far. I have not been feeling well. I've actually been uh, a little sick the last three or four days, so that's why I have not posted anything. I just hasn't felt well and didn't feel like recording. I just didn't feel like even playing. Uh, been doing a lot of sleeping and trying to get well, so that's where I've been. But I'm back, so let's get into this. Let's go into the phone. Uh -oh. Grab a gun and meet me at the bar, and make sure you're driving a decent set of wheels. Mm -hmm. All right, I'll be right there. All right, I'll be right there. There goes my Sunday. There goes my Sunday. Felt that way every day I go to work sometimes. There goes my day. All right, we got the casual suit and raincoat. It's kind of a cool look. Got the sunglasses, very good suit, got the tuxedo with the bow tie. We'll go with the this here, uh, Lincoln Clay. That's actually the person from uh, Mafia 3. I don't know why they included it in Mafia 2, the definitive edition, other than, I don't know. <laughs> but we'll see that character in the next edition once I finish this off. So we'll wear the raincoat one today so we can see the look here. See, there we go. Let's open the door. Uh-oh. Hi, guys. We just want to ask you some questions. If you don't open the door, we're going to open it up for you. Wow. Okay. Great neighborhood. I think it's the same lady from uh, Joey's place. That's funny. Alright. I'm going to head out the door. Oh, wait a minute. There we go. We're just going to back a little. It's a little too close. Let's go ahead and get a car. Uh, we'll get a decent set of wheels. So, let's get... Um, no, that's actually Lincoln Clay's car from uh, Mafia 3 that we'll be playing later. I know this because I played a little bit of Mafia 3, but I want to do these uh, Mafia 1, 2, and 3, and then go into 1, 2, and then go into 3. So, let's see. I feel like that volume is way so loud. Am I wrong in thinking that? It just sounds like it's so loud in my headset. Let me turn it down just a little bit more. I feel like it's so loud. That sounds a little quieter. No, 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 no. Where's my other car at? That's the Mercedes looking car. I'm gonna take that one. Alright, the roller. Alright, turn the roller on.
police car there. I need to find an ammo shop. Make sure I got plenty of ammo. So let's take and pull over here. Look at the map. Let's see, where are we going? This is home base. Doesn't show where I'm going. I need to find a ammo shop. Let's see, this is Giuseppe's. Fueling stations. There's ammo. Uh, God, I'm way far away from ammo. Mm. Giuseppe's doesn't have guns. He just has lock things, I believe. Let's see. Alright, that's Giuseppe's back there. go into Giuseppe's and see. I don't think he has guns. That's Giuseppe's there, isn't it? Um, uh, it's over here. Oh, Giuseppe, where's your shop? Trying to come and see if I can buy some things from you. I thought it was right here. It is. It's right here somewhere. This is the coal somebody was shoveling. And Giuseppe's was right around the corner from it. I thought it was right there, but I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Let's see. Hold on. Let's see. Got 36 rounds there. Load that. I've got 42. Got 48 there. We got 96 there. Got none there. None there. Hmm. How much cash do I got on hand? About $703. So let's take a journey over to the ammo place and get some ammo. Just make sure we're good. We have a damage marker our backing up that much. It didn't hit anything that damn hard. I mean, how it is. Whoops. Now we got damage on the front of the car. Whoops. Damn near ran the lady over. So that's never good. Alright. Let's see here. Go over here and buy some ammo, and then we'll go to the mission. There's the gun shop. Alright. Man, my poor car. Used to be a pretty car. What's up, buddy? Looking to buy a gun or you just need some ammo? Just need some ammo. 
Let's see. We have the revolver. We have the 367 Magnum. Ammo full. So 1911. We have the. Uh, we don't have the 1911. Oh, we do have the night. No, wait a minute. I guess we can't buy the gun because we already have the ammo. So. The ammo's full there. So, all we don't have is the 37 Magnum. So, let's go ahead and buy that weapon. Anything else I can do you for? Ammo, 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 ammo. Without some ammo. Full ammo. Full, uh. Full ammo, full ammo. Alright, we've got full ammo. Alright. That's all we need. Let's get out of here. We can head on to the mission now. Are you standing there, stupid? Get out the way. Walk right on the sidewalk and just stand there with right in front of the car. Oh! Dude! Seriously! Wow! Oh, hey, Johnny. What's up, Officer? Ostafer? I swear I'm not drunk. If we happen to run by a garage, we'll dip in real quick and repair the car. But I don't know how close. Yep, we're going to be right by. We've got a uh, repair right here. So. Uh, where's the garage door? It's not right there. I'm going pull in here. Nice to see you. There we go. What can I do you for, pal? All right, we'll repair the car. Uh, change the rims. For a new set of wheels. Take your pick, pal. Uh, yeah. Uh, I don't know about the plate. Paint. Change the paint hey, job. Pick a design. Oh, you can put pinstripes on it. I'm good with that. that. Browse color. Any color you like. Take your pick. Green. Yellow. Pale faces, fuchsias. I right, gold's cool. Lime greens and, and uh, pink. Uh, no, 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 and no. Um, I don't know. Hmm. I'm wasting all my money. Try it's only money, right? Dark gold. Yeah, we'll paint it gold. We'll be a little ostentatious here. Alright. We don't have enough to improve the engine performance. Thanks a lot. Alright. There we go. Now it's repaired and it looks good, so. I know gold is very ostentatious, but. Are you freaking serious? Jack wagon. Uh, 
I just got out the shop and freaking runs right into me. Idiot. You idiot. What are you doing? Freaking stupid. I had time out. I pulled you out of your car and shot you in the head. Not really. I'm not. I'm not that violent. There's a cop ahead. I ran the red light. Oh, I like it's greenish. I think. There's the bar. We'll pull over here. Introduce you to somebody. Vito, this is Carlo Falcone. Pleasure to meet you, Mr. Falcone. Vito? So, Vito, how do you feel about Alberto Clemente and Luco Gorino? Well, honestly, Mr. Falcone, the way I see it, those assholes tried to steal 5,000 bucks from me and then left me to rot in jail. That's good, because the two of them are planning to make a move on us. So it looks like we're going to have to do something before they do something. Hmm. Eddie will tell you the rest. I'm sure you won't let me down. Goodbye, Mr. Falcone. Nice to meet you, Vito. So what the hell's going on? A car with three of our guys in it disappeared last night. And word around town is that Luca might have had something to do with it. Who's missing? Harvey Beans and the two guys who were supposed to be protecting him, Tony Balls and Frankie the mm -hmm. Mick. Yeah. Beans is Carlo's accountant. If he talks, we're all fucked. What do you need me to do? I need you to wait for him in front of Freddy's and follow him to find out if he's involved. And then? If you find out that he had anything to do with this, you whack the bastard. And if any of our guys is still alive, try and rescue him. Hopefully you can find him before they spill the beans about our operation. Where do you think he'll go? I got no idea. So go prepared. Make sure you've got a fast car and some firepower. All right, no problem. Okay, stop by here when you're done. And Vito, don't tell nobody about this. Got it. Got it. All right. Arrivederci. I mean, we got a crazy mission ahead of us here. Let's get ready. I want to see if each gun shop is different, or just because your 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 mission level, you only allow certain access to certain guns. Yeah, it looks that way. Cause see, you got other gun racks that are empty here. I think you're only allowed so much weaponry. Are you looking to buy a gun, or you just Let's need see. some ammo? Yeah, yeah. So yeah, I can't get anything else. So that stinks. Okay, yeah. All right. At least now we know. You take care now, buddy. All right, there, buddy. Let's get going. Get on this mission. I guess since I have to have a fast car, I guess I'm going to follow somebody who's got a fast car. So, this will be interesting. What's up, Johnny? Yeah, the cop's kind of blind. There it is, following that car. Now, where are you, Luca? There's Luca. Okay, here we go. 
Shouldn't get too close. I gotta make sure Luca doesn't see me. I gotta follow him without being too close to him to alert him to my presence. So. This car's not that damn fast. I, mean, I could have driven a slower car. Might have been fine. Right by Joe's apartment over there. Oh, he just ran in the back of that car. Who taught you to drive? Hmm. Yeah, he didn't reach his destination because he hit a car in front of him. That's not my fault. Mm. That was stupid. How is that my doing? Because the dude can't drive. So now I got to do it all over again. That's just stupid. On down here. Oh, almost lost there. Oh, idiot. I mean, I hit him, but still. This is Lucas car. Now, where are you? Where's Luca? There's Luca, you rat. Okay, here we go. Oh, what's a bad looking car? Oh, sure damn it. Too close. I gotta make sure Luca doesn't see me. Now, Luca can manage not hitting anybody and make it to his destination. We might be able to get through this mission. And he hit somebody again. What a literal dumbass. I gotta catch up to him. Shit. Oh my god. How many cars is he going to hit? Where are you going, Luca? There he is. Clementi 
Eddie's slaughterhouse, of course. Looks like Eddie was right. Okay. I gotta get in there without being seen. Okay, we gotta get in there without being seen. So we'll go back here. I'm going through the sewers, maybe? The sewer. Maybe that's the way in. Looks like I can pry this off. <clears throat> there we go. Jesus Christ, that reeks. Yeah, that's why it's called a sewer. You know, new direct. Thing was massive. Let's see what we got here. Shit, that dog could be a problem. My dog could be a problem. Alright, see. Gonna go right. could just stop by to pick up some steaks. I'm gonna kill somebody. Ooh, hello. Sorry. Um. Um. Y'all didn't see that. That's um. Yeah. Um. Nudity. I didn't know that was gonna happen. Um. We'll ignore that. See if there's another way around. The dog's gonna lurk into my presence. So if I can get up around something, nah, it doesn't look. Well, okay. maybe. Time to move. There we go. Nice. Nice and quiet. That's what I going. meant, you. Keep looking the other way, guys. There we go. Hey, what was that screaming? Nothing. One of them pigs must have squealed. What? Nah, that was no pig. That sounded like... That shit in your ears. That was a pig. Just ignore it. Yeah, but... Are you around here or what? Shut the fuck up and get back to work, but it ain't gonna be the only pig in swim. Okay, okay. 
Okay, here he comes. So hopefully he'll go that way. Yeah, he's going in there. Good deal. We'll sneak around this way. So, uh, you still thinking about quitting? Yeah, probably next month. And what are you gonna do then? I was thinking of maybe, you know, becoming a voice actor. Are you kidding me? Who the hell would hire you? Hmm. Oh, guy with a gun. I just want to try and wait till he's walks away because it's him being right there. It cause a lot of disturbance. I'm trying to be quiet. Come on, buddy. Smoke a cigarette. Get out of the way. There you go. Cigarette's gone. Come on. Dude. Don't tell me he's going to stay there the whole entire time now. It looks that way. There we go. He's just gonna stand there the entire time, so maybe he'll do the same. Well, let's risk it. I don't want to open any door suddenly without making sure I can't sneak around it because that would be a bad, very bad thing to do. Okay, I can't get around there because those guys are there, so let's, um, try this door. Did that clear out the other way? No, guard's still there. So I can't go that way. Let's go this way.
Well, they're turned that way. Turn the opposite direction I am. There's nobody over there. There we go. Made it. Falcone thinks he's got a good racket going, but he ain't gonna get away with it. Come on. How'd you get it into the state? I don't know anything. I'm just an accountant. Don't fuck with me, you egghead bastard. You want to end up just like your buddy here? Come on, take a good look. You think you're tougher than him? After we're done with you, we're gonna grind you up in one of these machines here. <laughs> it's it's just a question how we're doing gonna be nice enough to fucking kill you first. <laughs> hey, what's that fucking stench? Oh! Hey, hey, somebody's Drop over there. Him. Hey, who the fuck are you supposed to be? Jesus Christ, what, what, is Captain Shitbag here to save the day? Shut the fuck up, Luca. Hey, I know you. You're the chump who was hanging around with that moron, Bagro. I thought you were still rotting in the can. What the fuck you think you're doing here? Falcone sent me. He isn't too fond of skinny little cocksuckers trying to turn his guys into mincemeat. Wow. So, you joined up with Falcone, huh? Well, I'll tell you what. If you knew what was really going on, you'd realize that you was better off in jail. But that don't matter now anyway. <laughs> oh, crap. Well, here we go. <laughs> Alright, well, we're gonna fight. Attaboy, Sammy! <laughs> Come on, break his fucking neck, Sammy. Damn it. You got me. Damn it. Two, three. Ah, uh, come on, baby. I'd hate to be you right now, asshole. Ah, boy, Sammy. Come on, Sammy, not so gentle. Come on, sucker. Atta boy, Sammy. Down you go, baby. Now we got to fight. Yeah, fuck with the wrong guys, assholes. Uh, Will you get me down, please? Thanks, Vito. We owe you one. Eddie sent you? Shit. Poor Frankie. I'm gonna kill that son of a bitch. Beans, stay here and don't come out until we come get you. Okay, okay. Just don't forget about me. Okay, fellas? Are you kidding me? 
<sighs> don't tell me I gotta redo this all over again. No, okay, I don't. You fuck with the wrong guys, asshole. Uh, get me down, will ya? Thanks, Vito. We owe you one. Eddie send you? Yeah, he noticed he was a couple of guys shy at roll call. Shit. Poor Frankie. I'm gonna kill that son of a bitch. Beans, stay here and don't come out until we come get you. Okay, okay. Just don't forget about me. Okay, fellas? I'm over here. Hey, Vito, let's go. All right, Vito, let's get that little fuck. Little cocksucker's gonna piss his pants. What's going on? They dead yet? Yeah, they are. Guess who's next? Too late. Here they come. I'm gonna switch up. Nice job. Now let's go get that little guy. Knock, knock. Come on. Let me in. Something heavy like a like a battering ram. I know. We'll use that cart. <laughs> Son of a wreck. <laughs> Thinks he's so fucking smart. Hmm. Think you're so fucking smart, huh? Go ahead. <laughs> Come on, Weasel. Wow. I'm gonna have a little fun with Luca before I grind him up. Wanna join me? Uh, thanks for the invitation, but 
I think I'll pass it. Huh? No, just take the side of Luca. I hear you, but you're missing out. I think I'm gonna try out that cattle prod he was yapping about. Uh, yeah, Eddie wanted me to take care of him personally. Don't worry about that. It'll just take a little longer this way. This fuck don't deserve a quick death. I can't argue with that. Okay, I'm gonna go. I stink like an outhouse. I gotta get cleaned up. And tell Eddie he don't gotta worry about Luca. Yo, Beans, open the door. It's all over. You? You're still alive? Yeah. What'd you expect? Look, before we go home, you wanna give me a hand with Sleeping Beauty here? You know, that's not such a bad idea. Hmm. Puzzling. We're gonna take Luca's car. We don't have to go so fast now. We'll just cruise back to our place. So did he, the quick question is, did he kill Luca or did they have a, uh, someone else in lay and wait and kill Joe or, hmm. Interesting. That Just the way that went down was funky. I don't know. Maybe Beans had something up his sleeve. And maybe uh, Joe had something up his sleeve. I don't know. Something's off there. I don't think I've got any money. Let's see. Stop. Oop, I only got 108 bucks. I guarantee it's not enough to fix the car. Oh, good afternoon. This car's got a lot of damage. We got a special on air freshness if you're interested. Yeah, you don't have enough. So, we'll have to just leave. Alright, I'll see you then. Alright, I'll see you then. Let's we'll make it back to our, our hideout, I guess. I guess we're going to the bar first, maybe. Tell me the job's done, or we going home, I wonder. bar first.
and he's going, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh Jesus Christ, was that you? Vito? Oh Jesus, why didn't you take a fucking bath before you came back? You told me to come right back when I was done. You think I'm enjoying this? Okay, okay, okay. What happened with Luca? It's done. All right. How about our guys? You find them? Yeah. Luca had him in the slaughterhouse. Frankie's dead. But balls and beans are fine. Luca was, uh, interrogating him when I got there. Any witnesses? Well, except for a dozen or so whoa, of Luca's whoa. bodyguards we uh, ran back, into. No, back up, okay? It was rough, Eddie. Yeah, it sounds like it got pretty hairy. But hey, you pulled it off and you got out of there in one piece, right? So go get cleaned up before you ruin everybody's appetite. And burn those fucking clothes you're wearing. My God. Nice. Hey, got five thousand dollars for that. Nice. Arrivederci. Let's go ahead and get in. And head to our house. Oh, I can't enter from this side. I can enter from the other side. Let's go over here. I could enter from over there, I guess. I hope you at least bathe before putting it on. Tailored suit and overcoat. Hmm. All right. Nice. Take care, sir, and please come again. Oh, now you're nice to me. Stupid, what the film mark? Oh. All right. Hey, Vito, you made it. Hey, Eddie. Oh, nice threads. Thanks. So, uh, what's the plan, fellas? What's with the suits? Vito. Mr. Falcone is gonna bring us into the family tonight. You and me. We're gonna be made. No oh, shit. Tonight? Yeah. Really? Why didn't you tell me before? What do we gotta do? You'll find out. But first, there's somebody who'd like to have a little word with you. <laughs> oh, Yo, Mr. Conant. <laughs> hey, kiddo. 
want to talk to you about what's going to happen today. Come here, have a seat. All right. <sighs> sure. And hey, thanks again for doing whatever you did to get me out of the can early. Now I make good on my second promise to you. Second promise? Yeah. I told you the next time we opened the books, we'd recommend you, didn't I? And now it's done. You had something to do with this, but you work for Frank Vinci. Yeah. I would have liked to have had you in our family. But I figure Joe there is your best friend. You guys grew up together. Just like me and Frank. Since Joe was working for Carlo the whole time you were inside, I recommended they take you in too when he got made. Thanks, Leo. I, I don't know what to say. You don't gotta say nothing. Not to me or anybody else. That's kind of the way this whole thing works, Vito. <laughs> hmm. yeah. Now, come on. We don't want to keep him waiting. All right. I'll see you fellas upstairs. What was that all about? Nah, nothing. Just, you know, talking about old times. Like that time when old Leo dropped the soap. Fuck you. All right, all right, all right. That's enough. Let's go. These are like two school kids, I swear to God. Interesting. Are we going to see the induction ceremony? Now listen to me, fellas. It's one at a time. Once you're inside, just do as you're told, okay? Joe, come on in. Hey. Good luck. Why you sit like that? You look like a doofus. All right, your turn, Vito. Gentlemen, this is Vito Scaletta. Vito, know that this family of ours is a secret. You are entering the Society of the Chosen. Hmm. A society which does not exist to the rest of the world. Our family means more to you from now on than your own family, or God, or your country. If I ask you to kill your own brother, you must do it. Show me which finger would pull the trigger. Repeat after me, Vito. If I were to betray the secret of our way of life. If I were to betray the secret of our way of life. May my soul burn in hell. Just like this saint. May my soul burn in hell. Just like this saint. Amico nostra. Gentlemen, I give you our new friend, Vito Scaletta. I am very pleased to have these two talented and honest men join us. Interesting. And I'm happy this has happened in the presence of our esteemed guests, especially Don Frank Vinci. And it's you might wonder why I'd take this risk again after spending almost seven years in a can. You see, where I grew up, the only guys who mattered were the guys who had the balls to take what they wanted. You will receive payment for your services from Eddie. Would you like to add anything, Frank? Whatever you do, gentlemen, stay away from the dope. No dope. It's our policy. You can make plenty of money. And after it's years of doing food. everybody else's dirty yeah, work, too many risks. I was willing to risk anything to finally be somebody. Nice. I guess this is all what you're doing for the family now that you're a made man. In the family. The reason why this doesn't play the voice or the music is because I have the music turned off because I don't want any copyright stuff. So that's why you don't really hear anything that goes on right now. If you actually have the game and play the submission, you'll hear what's being said. Let's see where we are. All right, that's the end of the balls and beans. We are now a made man in the Falcone family. Villa Scoletta. This is our home. Very nice. All right. Well, 
this will be the end of tonight. We will visit this again. But I hope you all enjoyed the uh, video. And uh, thank you again for the almost 41,000 uh, viewers. Uh, or views on my channel. means the world. Uh, thank you to the people who have commented. And thank you to the people who have subscribed. Please continue to watch and enjoy the videos. <clears throat> I, I'm going to continue to make them. I enjoy this very much. But y'all have a wonderful evening. We shall see you in the next one.